since it seems like lots of you are dabbling in the acrylic painting, I'm going to show a little, give you a little tip for mixing acrylics with water because if you're trying to do graffiti with acrylics, they're probably going to be too thick straight out of the jar unless you get the craft paints. But to get a smooth flowing line, you need to mix it with water so that it's thinner, so it's more liquidy and so it lays on the surface rather than globbing on. But if you don't mix the water and paint in a proper order, if you have a thick paint, you might run into a problem and it can take longer. So here's a little tip. This paint is pretty creamy already, so if I add a lot of water right away and mix it, let's see what happens. Hmm. Looks like it mixes pretty well. Now let's see what happens that I added so much water. Usually when you add too much water, oh, look at that, pretty smooth. Now once it dries, it'll probably look like that, a slightly transparent. Now, I'll show you what happens when you add way too much water. Who knows, maybe this paint's so damn good that <laughs> nothing will screw it up. Let's see. Hmm. This paint is pretty good. Because it's a high quality, even after I add a lot of water, it still retains it's line, the, the edges of the line. But what will happen when this dries, it will be way more transparent than the other one. Which is actually cool, it's sort of like a watercolor effect. Now, so now I'm gonna mix this thicker paint. This paint's not uh, liquidy when it comes out, see it's like a blob. So here's what happens if I add all the water I want to mix in right away. Say I want to make the paint. The th paint's pretty thick, so mixed with that much water, it will be a nice flowy consistency. But if I try to mix it in all that water, what happens is it breaks into a bunch of chunks, and then <clears throat> you've got to keep aiming all at all those little chunks to break them apart, and it takes forever. See, they just keep coming up in chunks. And this can take a few minutes and get really frustrating and disappointing and can be another factor in why you won't approach acrylic painting because you'll think, ah, crap, it's going to take forever. So I'll show you how to avoid that. First step, drink your chocolate hot milk. Next step, put the paint in there, and add a little tiny bitty drop. Now there's more paint than there is water, so as I start mixing it, it's kind of chunky. Maybe even still a little too much water to start with. But it's more doable because the chunks are right there and I can just keep smushing them. Because you just want to get the paint down to a liquidy consistency so that once you add more water, it's not, it's not, there's no solid pieces. 
and it starts to mix more like a liquid. No chunks, just bubbles. Hopefully this takes a little frustration out of your process with acrylic painting and you can give it a shot.